Hey y'all, what's up, what's up, what's up, man? This is the playoffs, man. This is the playoffs. It's been a rocky season. I mean, my Knicks made it to the playoffs for the first time, and this year, they're not in it. So, but I'm going to talk about one particular team that's been out the hunt and race for a while. And overall, I think this is the team to watch. The Golden State Warriors. Yes. You got Clay back in action. You got Steph Curry breaking records and shit this year. And you got Gary, what is it? You got Gary Payton Jr. over there. It's just something about it, man, because they've been waiting for a while to kind of get their uh, name back out there. So with the team that's going to shock the NBA the most this playoffs, I'm going to say the Golden State Warriors. Did I say they're going to win the championship? No. But they're going to shock the most. They just may pull that shit off, too. But they're going to have to get through Milwaukee. Um, but that being said, speaking of Milwaukee, at first, their second chances, I thought, was to a limit. But this season made a different turn. Last year, me and my buddy, the security guard, we predicted it. We said Giannis needs to win this year. This is the fucking year. That he needs to win. He got to get it out the way now. His next year may not be looking too good. He got that shit out the way. He got it. But this year. It is looking good. Because the team's been messing up. So therefore. You got to watch out. For Milwaukee. You got to watch out for the champs this year. Thinking they just got lucky. Last year. But they came back from a lot. But, you know, even I thought they weren't going to, you know, make it to the end this year. But now my chances is looking completely different. Last year I thought that. Before the season even started, like I thought that. But now, you know, I think it's a chance because of the way, once again. And the East is always shaky anyway. So you never know with the East. That's why you got to watch how you gamble in the East. Uh, Brooklyn end up being at the bottom and not at the top as usual. So, that may make a smooth ride for them. Okay. Kyrie is back in motion. He's feeling good. So, we're going to see how that goes. So, I really see a rematch of Milwaukee and Brooklyn. Uh, everyone, I'm still not leaving James Harden out with the system. Of him over in Philly. I really do think he worked better. Than in Philly. Than he did to Brooklyn. He just was thirsty. And rushed to Brooklyn. And now once again. The Knicks got to get up 80 players to get someone. A lot of big teams got to give up a whole fucking roster to get a player. So I was pissed at, off at that trade in general. But now that he's over there. In Philly. We're going to see how that goes because you, you, you can't knock out LaJoe and Bean, whatever. You, you can't count the man out. He cried too much that time when he lost and he done good in the playoffs. So he need to get off that. So let's not count them out. But James Harden has been known to be a choke artist for years and years and years and years. We give him props. We say he's one of the best even though he gained weight. Yeah. Offensive players in the league score and everything, but when he gets to that playoff thing, he never does it. If he can get to the third round, and then we should take a break and not call him a choke artist. But we don't know if he's gonna do that. So if it winds up Philly and Brooklyn, it's gonna be some shit. And if they end up being Philly and Brooklyn. And then Milwaukee is going to have a walk back to the playoffs. So just mark that down and remember that. So, or if they go the other way around, it may be Milwaukee versus uh, Brooklyn or anything. But if Milwaukee, man, look, I just know if Brooklyn plays Philly. And look, man, Milwaukee is going to beat Philly. I think Milwaukee can beat Philly. But Brooklyn is going to be a showdown, man. I don't know, but just remember the top team I said. 
That's the Golden State Warriors to watch out for. I haven't forget about you, Phoenix, either. That's in part two. Peace.